What's the difference between holistic medicine and Western medicine? People ask this all the time. Today, I'm going to share four differences between holistic medicine and Western medicine. Number one, holistic medicine treats the cause. Maybe there's a nutrient you're missing or a negative emotion that hasn't been released, or maybe there's a toxin in the body. Holistically, they're going to try and understand what the cause of the sickness is and work to correct it. With Western medicine, it treats the symptoms so you feel better. Typically, Western medicine doesn't understand the cause of many diseases, but they are able to suppress symptoms so you'll feel better. Number two, holistic medicine treats the entire person, including the body, mind, and spirit. There's an understanding that everything is connected and therefore affected. So the entire person has to be considered and treated. With Western medicine, it treats the part that's broken. It's been compared to taking your car to an auto mechanic to get fixed. Number three, holistic medicine believes the body has the power to heal itself. So when we're sick, the holistic practitioner will help the patient align himself or herself to heal. With Western medicine, it treats most health conditions with drugs. This is a standard treatment that doctors and pharmacists are taught in their education. Number four, in holistic health, the patient is responsible for his or her own health. Patients are encouraged to listen to their body and learn to trust their own guidance system when making decisions on their own health and healing. With Western medicine, patients must listen to their doctor who's the authority on health. How many times do we hear the message, ask your doctor if this is right for you? Don't stop taking this without asking for your doctor. We constantly hear messages that put the doctors on a pedestal so we look up to them as the authority on our health. Holistic medicine, Western medicine, which would you choose?